Welcome. In this video, I'll show how you can check and use the MAC address on a Windows computer. So in Windows, a MAC address is a unique identifier assigned to each network component like Wi-Fi, Ethernet or Bluetooth. So a computer can have multiple MAC addresses. These addresses allow networks to recognize and connect with the device. The first part of the MAC address, known as the OUI or Organizationally Unique Identifier, shows the manufacturer such as Realtek or Intel. MAC addresses are also useful in network security helping administrators manage and control device access on the network. And well, the first method to check the MAC address in Windows is to launch the Windows settings. Here enter the network and internet category. And now you can uh, check the Wi-Fi and Ethernet MAC addresses either separately from their respective categories or go into advanced network settings to check all of them simultaneously. But let's not get ahead of ourselves and start by Wi-Fi then go into hardware properties and here you'll find the physical address or MAC address of your Wi-Fi hardware module. The same goes for the Ethernet, so open this page here and you'll find the physical MAC address. Now you can also, as I've mentioned earlier, enter the advanced network settings, then go into hardware and connection properties and here pretty much find all of the MAC addresses that are assigned to your uh, hardware modules, should I say. So here we have the local area connection MAC address, another one here, the Wi-Fi MAC address, so the physical address or MAC address, here it is, the Bluetooth network connection module, Ethernet, actually two of them. So yeah, that's how you can do that through Windows settings. Now you can find all of the addresses that are assigned to your Windows computer through the command prompt. So first of all, make sure that you have the administrator rights, then go into the Windows search and type in command prompt, like is written here, or you can simply put in the CMD. Now launch the command prompt once again, make sure that you will do that as an administrator. And then here input the following command, that is IP config space backslash all. And then press enter. And here you can clearly see that we also has gotten a bunch of uh, hardware information and all of them include the respective physical address or MAC address of well, any given hardware module. So here you have the wireless LAN adapter Another one with a different MAC address. We also have the Wi-Fi adapter, the Bluetooth network connection. Here's its MAC address and the Ethernet as well. So that's another method you can opt for. And well, third and final method is to pretty much do a similar thing that we did with Common Prompt, but instead of, well, the CMD itself, we are going to use the Windows PowerShell tool, which is supposed to be a better terminal version for Windows. So it's pretty much the same thing, but different. So the order of business here is somewhat identical. Launch the Windows search and look for the PowerShell app or the PowerShell tool. Now run it as administrator and here input the following command. That is get slash net adapter. Then press enter. Wait a few seconds here. And you'll see also what hardware or hardware modules or interfaces you have built into your computer and their respective MAC addresses. As you can see, this way is the cleanest of them all. It just shows three modules and their respective MAC addresses. So if MAC addresses is everything that you're after, I would assume that this method is the easiest one and simply the most straightforward. So now once you know how to check the MAC address or rather MAC addresses of your Windows computer, Let's put it to good use with an assistance from ema.info webpage. So go to the ema.info MAC address check or simply follow the link in the video description. Here input the MAC address of your computer or any other hardware module or interface or Windows device that you would like to learn more about. Then press the check MAC address button and here also scroll down and click the check MAC address button. 
On this page you'll find the company name, the manufacturer of whatever hardware module you've entered the MAC address of. In my case that is Asus Tech Computer. Here you have the company address, the country of this company's origin, the OUI of the given MAC address and so on. If you will scroll down for just a tiny bit, you will also find 10 randomly generated MAC addresses for the same manufacturer. So as you can see here, the OUI of all those MAC addresses is identical, which means that they all belong to the same manufacturer company here. Now, if you would like to generate even more random MAC addresses, you can try using the MAC address generator tool. So once again, either go to the email.info slash MAC dash address dash generator or follow the second link you'll see in the video description. Here, select what brand you would like to generate this MAC address for. Uh, on this main page, we have a bunch of uh, smartphone brands, for example. So let me show how to do that for the Xiaomi phone. So here just press the button, but this procedure is identical for any manufacturer, any OEM pretty much. So it doesn't matter which one you'll go for in terms of procedure. Just note that whatever manufacturer you choose, the random MAC address that you'll get will all belong to this specific company. In this particular instance to Xiaomi. And well, as far as this video goes, that'll be it. So should you have any further questions, leave them in the comment section below this video. But as for now, thanks for watching and bye-bye.